I met Captain Matt Rush last June. He was at the hospital fighting a leg infection. Eventually, unfortunately, he lost one of his limbs. But today he is back, and he's not only back, he is walking again and not giving up. There they are. For Captain Matt Rush, coming back to his former fire station is like coming home. Mr. Rush, how are you doing? Yeah, by the end of the day, I'm usually pretty whooped and pretty tired, but you know, I've been back to work and I'm doing the training captain thing and I'm training you know, firefighters and recruits and I love it. But the road to recovery has not been easy. After weeks in the hospital, Matt lost one of his legs. Today, he's learning how to use a prosthetic. <laughs> Tell me what's happening right now. Oh, I'm just uh, taking, uh, taking a little pressure off this leg. It gets, it's kind of funny, the left leg gets tired and uh, so a lot of times I'll just do one of these things, you know, and stand on my, on my prosthetic. And that. just like a firefighter learning to fight the flames, Matt is now in a different fight, learning to literally walk again. When you first start off as a firefighter, you don't really, you don't know a whole lot. And, uh, and it's a lot of work to try to perfect your craft and to be good at what you, what you need to be good at. And, uh, and I've learned that I had to use that same determination to learn how to walk on this. Matt's goal is to actually on 9-11, climb up a ladder again. If not this time, then next year. He's got that type of grit, that type of work ethic, that type of determination that he can accomplish anything. It's like being back with family, the guys that he worked with day in and day out, and at the same time, really appreciating what the community has done for him. Does that add to the pressure a little bit? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no yeah, pressure. Now, now, yeah, don't, I, I better not slip and fall today because they're watching. <laughs> but no, it's, it's, uh, it's, been, it's been wonderful. And so now from his determination, maybe others will draw some inspiration. Patricio Espinosa, ABC 15, Arizona.